Hello, in this Excel tutorial we're going to learn how to add photos to your Excel worksheet as comments. Let's say for example you um, sell a product or you have a list of people and you want to include a photo. We can add photos to our cells in our worksheet as comments. So let's say here we have a standard worksheet. We have employee number, first name, last name, date of birth, and photo. So, you know, we're going to fill in just some whatever here. I'm going to put my own information in here. Okay, and now we get to the photo cell. Now let's say we wanted to add a photograph of, in this case, myself but in other cases whoever the person would be to this cell. What we're going to do is we are going to right click in the cell and we are going to go down to insert comment. And when you go to insert comment you get this uh, rectangular box which you can resize if you want. You can resize it in any way you want. And it has some uh, room for text. So what we're going to do is we're going to clear out what's already in there and normally what you would do with a comment is you would type in a text comment and you can do that. You can type in a text comment about whatever you want. You can see it's just like a text box. You have a lot of room there to type in pretty much anything you want. But in this case, in this example, what we're going to do is we're going to add a photo so we are going to point our mouse anywhere on the outside border of this comment box. You'll see when we're inside the comment box your pointer is the little eye beam. When you go to the outside it is the uh, you get the little uh, four-way arrow. So we're going to point anywhere on the outside border of the comment box and we are going to right click and then we're going to go down to Format Comment. And under Format Comment you can change uh, the color and the thickness of the border, you can change the, the color of the text box, you can change the font, all sorts of stuff that you can change just like a normal text box. What we're going to do is we are going to go to uh, under Fill this is the color of the text box. You'll notice right, well, you, yeah, you'll notice right now it's that tan color, okay? And it's the same there. So if you wanted to change, I'm getting off track a little bit here, but if you wanted to change the fill color, you just choose the fill color. Now you have a garish looking red text box. So as you can see, you can change all sorts of stuff about your text box. So I'm going to make turn it back to that. Well, that wasn't the color it was. Uh, Anyway, it doesn't really matter. There it was. So, under Fill, we are going to go down to Fill Effects. And up here under Fill Effects, you have four tabs. You have Gradient, you have Texture, you have Pattern, and you have Picture. So, I'm going to go to Picture. <clears throat> I'm going to select a picture. And I'm going to go under My Pictures here. And I am going to choose a picture. Okay, there's a good one. That's uh, a picture of myself. And we're going to click Insert. Okay, and there's uh, a picture of myself. We're going to lock the aspect ratio so it can't get distorted if the text box gets uh, resized in such a way. And then we're going to click OK. And obviously you can't see it because it's a little big for there, but when we click OK again, there's the picture. So now, if we go down here, click on another cell, that's what you get. You get the uh, employee number, the first name, the last name, the date of birth, and in this cell you get a little red uh, triangle. That little red triangle indicates that there is a comment. And when you hover your mouse, you don't have to click. When you hover your mouse over the cell, you get the picture. And like I said, you can do that with anything. You can do that with uh, pictures of products. You can do that with pictures of people, 
whatever you like. And you can put the comment wherever you want. So if you wanted to comment under the person's employee number, for example, you would again right click, you would choose insert comment, clear out what's in there already, then you would right click on the outside border, you would format comment, under fill you will go to fill effects, you will choose picture, you will select picture, find your picture, scroll through, find your picture, and insert. And then you would say OK, OK again, and there it is. So now if you wanted to get rid of this uh, column altogether and just have it like that, now you have the person's picture under their employee number. You could have it under their first name, their last name, whatever you wanted. So that's a quick and easy way to add pictures into your Excel worksheet as comments. I hope you've enjoyed this lesson and remember to keep visiting freelearnexcel.com for more Excel tutorials and tips and tricks. And remember if you have any questions about Excel, please do not hesitate to click on the Ask an Excel question link on the website, fill in the form, the question will be sent along to me and I will be happy to answer it for you. Thank you very much and have a great day.